Hello guys, I was asked to create a very short introduction video on how to use Blender Lattice and the Lattice modifier. So here it is, step by step. The first thing I do is to add a simple object and I choose Suzanne the Blender Monkey. Ok, here it is and I choose Smooth Shading and I add a subdivision modifier. This is not required to work with the Lattice modifier, but it just looks a bit nicer. Alright, the next step is to add the Lattice. Again, Shift A and choose Lattice. The Lattice is a deformation cage, which consists of a 3-dimensional grid of vertices. Now we'll scale it so that it fits the monkey head, but don't do this in edit mode, use the object mode instead. Scaling in edit mode will result in object deforming, which is probably not desired. The next step is to select the lattice, then the lattice tab, and here you can define the number of subdivision axes, which are named U, V and W. Once this is done, you select the object, then hold the shift key down to select the lattice as well, and after that press Ctrl and P and choose Lattice Deform. What this does is to add a lattice modifier to the monkey, and then use the lattice as object parameter. And now you can go ahead and select vertices of the lattice in edit mode and move these around to deform your object. You can use any kind of selection tool. I'm using here the box or lasso selection before I press G to move the selected vertices or press S to scale them. The lattice modifier can be used to deform meshes, curves, surfaces, text and even particles and it also works for many objects simultaneously. Once you're done with the deformations, you can apply the modifier and get rid of the lattice object. Ok guys, this was my short introduction to the Blender lattice and the modifier. I really hope you find it interesting and useful and if you do, don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. If you want to support me, please be my patron, this would really help a lot. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.